Rory Van Ult, a seven-year-old girl from Canada, was recently crowned as the youth national champion in the USA weightlifting under 30 kg weight class. The youngest national champion in the history of weightlifting in the US can deadlift 80 kg and snatch 32 kg. The four feet tall girl can also squat 61 kgs and earned the nickname of the strongest girl in the world for her impressive strength. While her feet amazes many, it also brings forth one of the most common myths associated with weightlifting to the fore. It is not safe for kids to lift weights as it might hurt their growth plates. What is a growth plate? A growth plate is also known as the epiphyseal plate or physis. It is an area of developing tissue located near the ends of long bones. Growth generally takes place at these ends. Growth plates include the femur, that's the thigh bone, the lower legs, the forearm and the bones in the hands and feet. Each long bone has two growth plates for adding length and width to the bone. Growth plates are also extremely vulnerable because these are weaker than the ligaments and tendons which connect the bones to one another. Here are the myths associated with weightlifting. Weightlifting stunts height of children. Weightlifting decreases flexibility and weightlifting is bad for the joints. However, there is no scientific evidence or research that weightlifting will halt the growth in kids. In fact, supervised weightlifting training for kids will help in increasing strength and bone strength index. Doctors and health experts believe that such myths originated because it was thought that kids might damage their growth plates during weight training. Let's listen to what Rishabh Jaisawal, founder and high performance director at Sporting Ethos, thinks about the matter. One of the biggest myths that's been around for many years is that weightlifting can stunt a child's growth and also probably that it can lead to injuries. Now let me break it down for you. Weight training is nothing but resistance training. So even a simple push-up is a form of resistance training. What matters here is that the exercises are being supervised, uh, they are technically correct and there is a progression which is scientific in nature so that the child is having good functional movement and then they have a good endurance so that they don't get fatigued and then they are building strength on top of that using resistance training. The other part about growth being stunted, well actually it's mostly a form of the nutrition so we have to ensure that obviously if they are playing and if they are working out they need to have an adequate diet which is balanced in terms of their macros as well as their micronutrients and also taking care of other parameters such as their sleep, hydration. So all these things combined will actually take care of the growth part. Dr. S. B. Gupta, a pediatrician, however, opines that weightlifting at an early age can affect the overall growth of kids if done in excess. So long ago, 18 years ago, the growth करीब करीब स्टेबल हो जाता है और उनकी लंबाई बढ़नी बंद हो जाती है उसके बाद बच्चे वेट लिफ्टिंग कर सकते हैं क्योंकि उनकी हड्डियां भी मजबूत हो जाती हैं ज्यादा वेट लिफ्टिंग करने से बोन्स की ग्रोथ प्लेट डैमेज हो सकती है जो कि पार्शियल या कंप्लीट रूप से बोन ग्रोथ को प्रभावित करती है और बच्चों की लंबाई को काफी हद तक छोटा कर सकती है तो हर उम्र में हर वजन के बच्चों में इसका अलग अलग पैरामीटर हो सकता है लेकिन फिर भी वेट लिफ्टिंग 16 से 18 वर्ष के नीचे वर्ग में अवॉइड करना चाहिए सो इफ अ टीन और एडोलेसेंट इज इंटरेस्टेड इन वेट लिफ्टिंग इट इज एसेंशियल दैट दे आर सुपरवाइज्ड बाय अ सर्टिफाइड ट्रेनर or coach it is also necessary to talk to a doctor to make sure that your kid is ready for weightlifting training
अ टाइम्स ऑनलाइन रिपोर्ट